Yo, what up everybody? It's Eclipse from Team Ruthless and this is my build for everybody who has been struggling with the final boss. You can probably use this boss or this build for any of the bosses in the game. Um, in my opinion, the game's not that hard. So, <laughs> I'm sorry you guys are struggling. I will admit that the last boss is kind of a, um, what's the word? I don't even remember the word right now. It's uh, definitely harder than the rest of the game. Um, rest of the game. So I understand why people are having difficulties, especially if it's like your first Armored core light game. Um, so yeah, and I'm pretty sure I showed my first build on the first fall boss fight. But anyways, this fight will freaking, this boss with this fight, this build will literally be every, you can probably use this on every boss. Eclipse, fucking the helicopter, or plane that flies around, um, the snake thing, uh, Zarook, all those bosses. Um, you know, I'll also fight the boss again. And I'm gonna show y'all a little something just in case you fight the boss and there's a little secret to it that they don't really tell you. Yeah, my victory is trash. There's a little secret <laughs> to it that they don't tell you that I didn't find out till after I beat the boss. So, <laughs> all right, I'm gonna stop this for now and we're gonna come back and I'm gonna fight the boss. All right, so pretty much wanna be, just pretty much be in his face or just, you don't even gotta be in his face. You just really gotta like, be far enough to like not worry about his um spin attack and just launch him and he'll be done in no minute if oh boost out of that if you want to make it fancy throw on um or beat him even faster throw on um assault shift and here's the secret if you guys didn't notice i didn't notice till after i beat him but you can, all these are bombs that you can throw at them. And these do a shit. Ah! The spin move is the move you want to watch out the most. It's kind of easy to dodge. If you're using melee, be careful. Oh, I fucked up. He'll take your guns if you do that. But even if he takes your guns, you can just come grab these. Oh, I missed him. I hit his stupid, um, oh, watch out for his laser too. And then you don't need to bring a oh, shorter weapon, but it doesn't hurt. As you, Deadly Driver does a lot of damage. The other ones are probably actually better, but I like Deadly Driver. He's almost dead already and I'm playing around. But yeah, I would just go dual bazooka arms, and again, you can you can beat you can beat him. And I don't even have that many mods on. Like, I don't have any um, damage mods. I had like one damage mod on one of my launchers. Like, it, he's really not that hard. Like, if you're having trouble with bosses, just go double bazooka arms, and, and that's just really it. Like, there's really not much to this boss. Um, so hopefully this helps you guys who are still having a hard time a year later. <laughs> Um, I know there's a lot of new people getting into the series and stuff, and uh, if y'all haven't beat this, don't watch this part. Spoilers. <laughs> Alright, I hope y'all enjoyed this. Peace.